Behind us, you have $1.6 million worth of new fire trucks. Uh, there's a fifth one on the way, be here a few months from now. And it's just representative of the effort that we've got to make sure that our first responders have the tools and equipment they need to do the job. These are great trucks. They have a lot more capacity, capability uh, than our old trucks. I think the firefighters are very proud of them. They're glad to be able to ride around in and out citizens and these are their dollars and it's a, hopefully it's a reflection that we're being good stewards of uh, their tax dollars. The new Rosenbauers we purchased were basically chosen because of a number of key features and elements that we've been looking for in a modern fire truck. Uh, one thing they do have that most people have not heard about is an auxiliary power unit which basically the big diesel engine will shut down after a few minutes if they're not pumping. This creates less emissions and it, it, it improves the longevity of the diesel engines because they are not designed to, to idle. Yeah, we're really excited to have these new vehicles in our fleet. A lot of the vehicles that were in our fleet were older vehicles that needed to be replaced and uh, had a lot of miles on them, the wear and tear, and they've, they served our department well over a period of 20 years. But as with anything, we needed to replace them and we were able to update that with the help of the administration and with the help of these new trucks coming in here, our firefighters are excited about having them. Being a fire department that's proactive and being able to get newer technology and newer fire trucks for our personnel where they can come in and, and respond to the citizens' needs, we're real excited to have them.